The current detention center in Teton County was built in 1986 with the intention of housing up to 31 inmates. Modifications have since been made and today the facility is bursting at the seams with 45 inmates. We are what we call now functionally overcrowded. In other words, the kitchen, the laundry, uh, the visitation rooms are all way overtaxed with the number of inmates we have. Town and county officials hope to build a new justice center to house 102 inmates, the county's dispatch center, the Jackson Police Department, Sheriff's Office, and Victim Witness Services. The total cost of this facility right now is approximately $53 million. Uh, the detention center in there would be about $19 million of that. To save money and space, the Justice Center will be built on land that is presently owned by the county. The federal courthouse building will be moved across Simpson Street, and the Justice Center will stand in its place. Officials hope to pay for the project with money from the Specific Purpose Excise Tax, or SPET tax. The public will have five different items they will vote for on where the money from the spent tax will go to. Uh, approximately $11 million a year is brought in from that. And the, and the Justice Center is one of the five items on that ballot. We hope to have uh, the public understand the need for this here and uh, to vote for that. If the Justice Center is approved at the August 19th primary election, officials hope to break ground this spring. Construction is expected to take 14 to 16 months. In Jackson, I'm Cheryl Lee for K2 News.